So you're just getting into cars or you've had one for years and you want to fix it or, you know, fix it up. But one thing is troubling you. You don't know where to buy car parts from. Well, I'm here to answer that for you. Just a disclaimer though, none of these companies sponsor me, but they're who I go to or know people that use them. And if you're new here, my name is Matt and this is Rockers Drive Club. Please smash that like and subscribe button and click that bell so you won't miss the next video. Where do you buy car parts from? I've been getting this question from so many people and the thing is, it's not really a simple answer. You have multiple options and some of you more than the others. Stick around to the end for a mega tip. First, we gotta figure out a few things. One, are you looking for an aftermarket upgrade or an OEM replacement? And two, what kind of car are you looking to fix or upgrade? If you're looking for OEM or OEM plus, the first place I look is rockauto.com. They normally have the best prices for parts and almost any part that you're looking for from a specific bolt to the OEM wheels. Other places that you can check out is your local auto parts store. This could be AutoZone, Advance Auto, O'Reilly, Pep Boys, etc. Depending on the car and the area that you're in, they may not have the part or they have to order it. And chances are, it'll be a little bit more expensive than Rock Auto. You can also go to your dealership. If it's a specific part that you need, they can give you a part number and you can get it directly from them. I would not recommend you using the dealership to install the part because they like to mark up their prices. Side notes. Number one, some dealerships allow you to bring your car in for upgrades, such as Volvo. You can get a Polestar tune just by taking it to your local dealership. Number two, any part you buy, you can take it to most shops and they'll install it for you. But be warned, they will not warranty the part and sometimes they won't even warranty their labor. Dealerships will most likely decline using parts you bought due to not wanting to be liable if the part fails prematurely. Now let's discuss aftermarket upgrades. This is where it gets a little tricky. There's not much of a one-stop shop when it comes to buying upgrades. It really just depends on your car. Some cars are generally not modified, so it's harder to source upgrades. To start it off, BMW and its European brethren and competitors can use FCP Euro. Not only do they have parts, they have guides to build your car as well. ECS Tuning is another great one that mainly focuses on German cars. Here you can find anything from connecting rod bearings to complete cylinder heads. They have it all, even when it comes to body parts. But Matto, I have a Japanese sh box. That's okay. Nissan Z owners, check out Z1 Motorsports. They modify everything from R34 Skylines to Nissan Jukes and Sentras. Honda owners, check out MA Performance, Pro Civic. There's too many to name. You have options out there, even eBay, but be warned, some of those parts can be poorly made. A general reminder is price usually equates quality. A general website to find upgrades is Car ID also. Mazda owners can check out tuningpro.co. Mitsubishi can also check out MA Performance, Tuning Pro, and Cobb Tuning. Subaru is also in the same boat. Now for American boats, I mean cars. Dodge owners, your sites will be Modern Muscle Extreme, Livernoy Motorsport, and Vicrease. Hope I said that right. For Mustang owners, check out American Muscle, CJ Pony Parts, and Steeda. There's a lot of history there. Chevy owners can check out Fast Tech Performance. I didn't forget about my Korean crew, Kia and Hyundai, or Hyundai. You guys can check out Extreme Powerhouse, Vivid Racing, and MA Performance. Generally, these sites have what you need to start modifying your car. If I missed your car, that's okay because for the final major tip, I'm going to show you how to master the knowledge of your own car. I, contrary to popular belief, don't know everything about cars, but because they're a passion of mine, I strive to learn everything I can. That being said, I don't know what car you guys are all driving, but if you want to know how to learn more about your car, chances are there's a forum for it. Just Google your car as specific as possible. For example, I'd look up 2012 Volvo S60 T6, then I'd type whatever I want to learn or find about that car. So I'd say performance upgrades. And from there, almost everything I want to learn about upgrading my Volvo will be there. In these forums, you can also search because there's more than likely somebody else just like you out there trying to do the same exact thing. I hope this helped and if it did, please smash that subscribe button so I can continue the show and teach you guys about cars. Like I said, my name is Matt and this is Rockers Drive Club.